Hey friends, this is Donovan from Cruise Craze TV. I uh, only have a few seconds with you. We're getting, we just boarded a tender in the, um, at the Belize port. You have to take a tender over to the island. And I've only got a few seconds to intro this until we have to sit down and get going. But I wanted to uh, take you on this trip with us. When we get on the mainland, we'll, uh, we'll do a little bit more video. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up uh, and follow us. We have some other videos uh, for Honduras and some other places you'll want to be a part of. If you have any comments, put them in our comments section down below. We'd love to hear from you. Here we go. We're going to take our, our trip and then we'll, when we get on the, on the island, we'll connect back with you. Thanks. Okay, friends, well, once you get off of the tender, uh, you're faced with just throngs of people. And uh, actually, you, you uh, walk out right into a long strip of nothing but shops. Shop after shop after shop. There's jewelry shops that we've talked about before all over the place. Um, this is a cool little place, that, and we'll see it in just a second, that has some swings. It is really the only restaurant that is here at this stop in Belize. It's called De Bourbon Barrel Restaurant and Bar. Uh, I'll show you here some of the some of the things that they have at the restaurant. It's open air, um, an open air bar kind of setting. Uh, it has lots of drinks, that, uh, if you're a drinker, that you might be interested in. But also, it has a full selection of different kinds of food. Uh, we ate there. It was very, very good. Uh, prices would, are about what you would expect to be in kind of a resorty area. They weren't really just over the top. But uh, you go in here, it's open, open air. You go and just find yourself uh, a seat. Sometimes they'll help you. Sometimes there's not anybody there to, to seat you. So you just go and scout out and find you the space that you need um, to eat. And so that's what we did. Again, it's open air. It's very, very loud, I'll just say. And so if you get frustrated, you might want, want to uh, think about that. Um, this is a, a small mall that they have there, an outdoor mall that has all kinds of uh, this particular shop has mainly uh, attire. It's pretty small. It has Caribbean kind of shirts and uh, t-shirts, things like that. Um, the prices are pretty reasonable. Uh, Keychains, shot glasses, bracelets, um, things like that. Uh, magnets, a lot of you may collect magnets or hats or things like that. So um, then as you continue to walk out here, uh, again, is on your right is the restaurant with these swings. Isn't this cool? My granddaughter and grandson uh, swing on those and they just, it's so great. Again, I just wanna warn you, they have a, a DJ that's out there playing music. It is extremely, extremely loud. You have to scream to talk over them. Uh, here's a Belize sign. A lot of people take advantage of opportunity here to uh, get their picture made or to, to do a selfie and with a Belize sign. Um, and it's all just right here in this outside area. This is a shop that's right in that area as well. And it is, well, it is what you see. It is nothing but leather goods like purses and wallets and things like that. It is high dollar, high, uh, big name, Louis Vuitton, um, things like that. Uh, now, whether or not they're real, who knows? 
Uh, I think they say that they are, but you would just have to be your own judge. They are very inexpensive. My daughter bought some of them, as a matter of fact, while we were there. And so uh, I, I think it's worth you looking at. There are other all kinds of other shops, and that's mainly what there is. This is my favorite shop uh, there in Belize. Uh, it's very open and clean and has a lot of things. Uh, you can, uh, some of the shops you have to push your way through because everything's so jammed together. This one is open and uh, has lots of space. It's, it, there it is, it's called a Jungle Gift Shop. And uh, so it is, it's just right there across from where you get off. Um, it has t-shirts, all this, all the stuff that you would want, lanyards, um, keychains, things like that, you can see here. There are other places uh, down the strip that have similar things, but for me, this is my favorite uh, shop to go into when I get to the police port. See, here's other shops. There's another shop right there. Um, there is a place here called the Wet Lizard. It's a little area, and it is really a bar, and uh, so, it is similar to the other one we just saw, except it really doesn't lend itself much to food, but drinking. So, you might try it. Thanks for joining us, guys, on our trip here to beautiful Belize. Um, if you have any questions that you would like to ask us, go ahead and put it in the comments below here. We'd love it if you would, uh, if you'd like us, follow us on YouTube. We do all kinds of other excursions and uh, other trips. Matter of fact, you might have uh, might find our trip to Honduras pretty interesting. A lot of times, the cruise ships that go to Belize also go to Honduras, uh, to Roton, Honduras. We have another video on that port as well. Uh, again, like us, follow us, post any comments that you might have down in the comment section. We'd love to hear from you about this video and other videos. Um, and your suggestions of places you'd like for us to travel, places you'd like for us to share information that will help you to enjoy your vacation more. So until next time, I'm getting ready to go get on our ship. Until next time, just want to say bon voyage, guys, from Cruise Craze TV. Bye.